One of Lakeland's largest events will light up the city streets. Families are gearing up for a night of fun at the annual Christmas parade. Yes, there is a bit of a detour you need to know about this year, though. Eight on your side's Beth Rousseau joining us live with the changes you'll see tonight. A parade that you've gone to most of your life, Beth. Yes, I grew up going to this parade living in Lakeland. I told you that spots along the parade route fill up fast. Take a look. We got one, two, three rows of seats in some area. You got to appreciate the commitment of the families who are set up here along Main Street. They say it's all in the name of some good old holiday fun. It's an early morning for many families in Polk County. I'm putting up the chairs this morning for the Christmas parade. Saving spots on the seat line streets so they'll have the perfect view of the 42nd annual Lakeland Christmas parade. Well, the earlier people put out chairs, the earlier I have to get up and put out chairs. <laughs> <laughs> the setup you're seeing is part of the tradition. It all culminates in a dazzling display of marching bands, floats, and Santa himself. This year's route is a little different due to construction on Orange Street. City leaders considered including all Lake Morton in the new course, but many voiced concerns about the area's infamous swans. Ultimately, they decided it was too costly to put up fencing to protect the wildlife. With the route set, seat planning starts. My friend, actually, Christine, she mapped it out, highlighted, we can go here, we'll park here with arrows, everything. And it seems like everyone has their own techniques. What I do is I have a, uh, a cable lock, uh, like a bicycle cable lock that I just run through all the chairs and I chain it around a tree. This is the same location we've been in all of those years. All the effort is worth it when the parade starts to roll. You know, I think it's one of those kickoffs to the Christmas time of year and it's something that brings family and friends together. Holiday fun families and friends enjoy together each and every year. For us we're just a family tradition and this is just a something we do as a family so the longer you do it the more special it becomes. All right, so the families who are already set up out here and those that come later, they're going to be treated to a parade that is themed Christmas in Candyland. The majority of the road closures start at 5 o'clock, and trust me, you're going to know when the parade itself kicks off because there's going to be fireworks flying. If you're thinking about coming, go ahead and do it because Avery Dan, I can vouch for it. It is a good time. I have to ask you, Beth, was there a spot that your family always set up their chairs? Okay, so actually the school that I went to for elementary and middle school was on the parade route. So my dad would take the afternoon up, set, off, set up, I should say, then when we would get off at three, we would spend the whole afternoon until seven sitting there with our friends. He would bring snacks. It was a whole thing. We were there until the parade was over at 8.30 or 9 at night. It was Aww. such a good time. Aww, I love that. Sweet.